Hi, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to create this transition in After Effects. So, let's start. First, you need to create a new composition. Um, I'm going to use the HDTV 1080 preset and my duration is 4 seconds. So now you need to create a new shape layer. And when you do that, you can see that it is empty. So we need to add a rectangle. Then we're going to change the size of the rectangle and we're going to set it to 240. And as you can see right now, we need a fill. So we're going to add a fill like that. And we're going to use a blue fill. Okay. And right now, let's duplicate this rectangle by pressing Ctrl D and we have two rectangles. So let's create a position keyframe for the second rectangle. Um, let's set its position to minus 240 like that so that it is up there. Um, then let's move 10 frames forwards by pressing shift and page down and then let's set this to zero. So right now we've got this. Um, then we're going to add merge paths and we're going to change the mode. We are going to set it to intersect and right now we've got this. So we want to set these um, rectangles, in fact this one rectangle, to be right here. So let's click on transform and right now let's change the position to 0 and 0 and as you can see um, we can only see one quarter of our rectangle. So that's why we need to change the position to 120 like this so that we can see the whole um, rectangle. Now we've got this. So let's add a repeater and let's adjust its settings. So first, as you can see, um, we need the position to be offset by 240 and we need um, eight copies or maybe seven, no, eight. Um, right now we've got this which is not really interesting um, and not the effect that we're trying to achieve. So the trick right here is to set the rotation to 180 degrees and right now we've got a much more interesting animation. So now we need to add a second repeater and we're going to need five um, copies. We're going to set this value to zero and this one to 240. And as you can see, now we've got um, our completed transition. So right now what you can do is you can duplicate this shape layer and then you can offset these two by one or two frames like that. Now you can change um, the fill colors. You can set this one to a really light blue. Then you can change the fill color of this layer like that. And now if you do a RAM preview, this is what we've got. So if you want this transition to reveal a text layer or any layer, um, this is what you're gonna need to do. So first you need to create that layer so let's just make a text layer and let's type in text. Then let's quickly align it to the center of the composition. And we want the last um, shape layer, layer 3, to reveal the text. So we're going to press Ctrl D, which is going to duplicate that layer. Then we're going to move it on top of our text layer and we're going to set the track mat of our text layer to alpha mat. And right now, if we play this, we've got a nice transition that reveals our text layer. 
So that's it for today's tutorial. For more tutorials, please check out my channel and subscribe. Thank you for watching and see you next time.